Easter in Hudson Valley, the victim of a racist tirade from a man claiming to be a state trooper, and the disturbing confrontation was caught on camera. Troopers act? You. That's how troopers act? You. But officials for the New York State Troopers say this man is not and never was a trooper, and now the real police are looking for him. Eyewitness News reporter Marcus Solis live in Newburgh with the latest on this story. Marcus. Well, David Liz, as a pastor, the victim says he forgives the man seen in that video. However, that victim is also a police lieutenant, and so he says he doesn't want that individual to face charges. It's a shocking display of anger fueled by racial slurs. I'm an off-duty trooper, you stop it. And it may not be the, the most disturbing video. More on that in a minute. State police are looking to interview this man who spewed the N-word at another motorist and his son in Newburgh Saturday afternoon. I just couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe that, you know, the racial epithets, you know what I'm saying, that he was a cop uh, or a trooper. Um, but most of all, you know, just him doing what he did, and he's an older gentleman. Robert McLemore says the white motorist became upset when McLemore slowed down to let another vehicle pass in front of him. McLemore says the driver waved a box cutter, almost rear-ended him, then followed him into the parking lot of a restaurant where he claimed he was an off-duty trooper. You're that be white. You'll never be white. That's how troopers act. Cursed and flashed That's the middle finger. 45 years I've been living. I've been living here. Nobody's ever done it. And flashed the middle finger. 45 years I've been living here. Nobody's ever done anything like this. Nobody's ever put, uh, um, you know, a, a box cutter to my face or anything like that or disrespected me in any way. So I was shocked. But that wasn't the end of it. This is the second video a short time later when the driver tries to stab McLemore, actually poking a small hole in his phone case. The driver hasn't been identified, but he is not a resident of the city. I just couldn't believe someone would use those words in 2022 in the city of Newburgh. The irony is that McLemore is a cop, a lieutenant in the town of Wallkill, as well as a church pastor. He could have taken police action the moment a knife was displayed, but opted to file a report instead to spare his son any additional trauma. I replay it in my mind um, probably like every three seconds. I replayed in my mind of what I could have done. The mayor says there was a second incident shortly after in which a Hispanic couple was targeted, allegedly by that same driver, who again, police are looking to interview.